FC25 just got a new update today. We're going over the highlights from the new October 2nd squad update. This update is going to remove players, it's going to add players, and it's going to update player stats as well. If you do enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like for me. Make sure you subscribe as well so you don't miss any FC25 updates. So let's start with the removed players. So we've got Mazalu from Brighton, 84 potential, 66 overall. We've got Solet from Salzburg, 83 potential. Varane from Como also got removed. I think he announced his retirement recently. We've got Bulbul from Galatasaray, 80 potential for him. And then we go down the list and you can see some other players like Victor Moreno, Salcedo from Inter. Andy Carroll has also been removed as well. Let's take a look at the added players now. So we've got a player from Crystal Palace, Agbenun, 18 years old, 65 overall, 82 potential. Melia from St. Patrick's, 81 potential, 16 years old. And then we've got Degree from Underlecht. And then we go down the list. You can see other players here. Anthony Martial returns. He's playing at AEK Athens now. Carlos Vela for LAFC. Klaassen for Ajax. And then we've got Gezal as well. So if you haven't started a new career mode yet, this could be a good time to begin using this squad update because it's going to remove players that shouldn't be there and add players that should be there. Now let's take a look at the players that got updated. So we've got Laminia Mal from Barcelona. He got some upgrades to finishing, short passing, dribbling curve, ball control, shot power, long shots, aggression, positioning, and vision. He put on a few kilos as well, but no change to his overall and 94 potential. Next up, we have Saka from Arsenal. This guy got some upgrades to short passing, curve, free kick, accuracy, and reactions. No changes to his overall and potential. And then we've got Sesko from Leipzig. He got a lot of upgrades this week. Finishing, heading, short passing, dribbling, long passing, ball control, reaction, stamina, long shots, positioning, vision, composure. His overall increased to 80. Potential went up to 89. Cole Palmer this week got a lot of upgrades. He plays for Chelsea. Crossing, finishing, curve, free kicks, acceleration, sprint speed, agility, reactions, and then so much more there. Too many to talk about. His overall increased to 86. His position changed to a cam. International reputation, four stars now, but no change to his 89 potential. Barcola from PSG is up next. He got upgrades to finishing, dribbling, ball control, long shots, interceptions, positioning, marking, standing tackle increase as well. Overall went up to 81, potential went up to 88. International reputation is three stars now. Next up is Hernandez, who plays for Milan. He only got a potential downgrade this week, 89 down to 88. Vendevin from Spurs is up next. He got upgrades to acceleration, sprint speed, jumping, strength, sliding tackle, and potential. He's got an 87 potential now. Pablo Barrios from Atletico Madrid is up next. He got upgrades to volleys, dribbling, curve, ball control, acceleration, sprint speed, agility, balance, standing tackle as well. His overall went up to 77, potential went up to 87. Next up is Pavlovich from Bayern Munich. He got upgrades to crossing, heading accuracy, short passing, dribbling, long passing, ball control reactions, and so many other things there. His overall went up to 75 now from 73 and potential went from 85 up to 87. Luke Bar from Leipzig is up next. He got upgrades to heading accuracy, short passing, dribbling, long passing, jumping, stamina, strength, aggression, interceptions, and a couple other things there. His overall increased to 80, potential went up to 87. Joao Felix from Chelsea got an overall upgrade to 81, and a position change to Cam now. Rig from Sunderland got a lot of upgrades this week. Too many to talk about, but his overall went up to 66. It used to be 61, so a five-point upgrade there. And potential went up by 2, 84 up to 86. Sudakov from Shakhtar Donetsk got upgrades to dribbling, free kicks, acceleration, sprint speed, agility, shot power, jumping. His overall went up to 78. Next up, we have Larson from Frankfurt. He got upgrades to finishing, heading accuracy, short passing, volleys, curve, free kicks, stamina, long shots, vision, and so much more there. His overall went up to 75. Potential stays at 86. Eleni Kenner from Monaco is up next. He got upgrades to heading accuracy, volleys, ball control, reactions, positioning, composure. His overall increased by 2 to 72. And Waneri from Arsenal got upgrades to crossing, short passing, dribbling, long passing, ball control, acceleration, sprint speed, agility, reactions, balance, jumping, positioning, vision, and composure. His overall went up by 2 to 66. Potential stays at 86. Yildiz from Juventus is up next. He got upgrades to finishing, short passing, volleys, curve, long passing, reaction, shot power, long shots, positioning, and vision. His overall went up to 71. Potential went up to 86. Next up, we have David Raya, who plays for Arsenal. He got a lot of upgrades to his goalkeeping stats. His overall went up to 84. Potential went up to 86. And then we've got Stefan Bajetic. He plays for Salzburg. He got upgrades to short passing, dribbling, long passing, reactions, interceptions, tackling, and more. His overall went up to 73. And potential went up to 86. Alex Boehner is up next. He plays for Villarreal. He got some upgrades to crossing, short passing, dribbling, curve, long passing, reactions, and more. His overall went up to 80. Potential went up to 86. Adrian Lissor from Real Zaragoza is up next. 
Finishing went up volleys, dribbling, curve, shot power, balance, agility, sprint speed. His overall went up to 69 and potential went down to 85. Next up we have Tillman who plays for PSV. He got upgrades to finishing, heading, long passing, ball control, reactions, jumping, stamina and more. His overall and potential did stay the same. And then we've got Graven Birch from Liverpool. He got upgrades to dribbling, long passing, ball control, reactions, balance, jumping, strength, marking, tackling and more. His overall went up to 79, potential went up to 85. Jackson from Chelsea is up next. He got upgrades to finishing crossing, heading, curve, long passing, ball control, jumping, balance, strength, and so much more there. His overall went up to 80, potential went up to 85. Lucas Baralda from PSG is up next. He just got a potential downgrade, 86 down to 85 now. Next up we have Harder from Sporting. He got upgrades to finishing, heading, volleys, dribbling, ball control reactions, shot power, jumping, and so much more there. His overall went up by 3 to 65, potential went up by 5, from 80 up to 85, so that is a massive jump. Lavia from Chelsea is up next. He got upgrades to crossing, heading, dribbling, long passing, ball control, acceleration, sprint speed, jumping, strength, and aggression, and vision. His overall and potential stay the same. Next up is Ekatike from Frankfurt. His finishing was downgraded, but he got upgrades to short passing, volleys, dribbling, curve, ball control, agility, reaction, shot power, aggression, positioning, and vision, and a lot of other things there. His overall went up to 77, potential went up by 2 to 84 now. Next up is Simon from Stuttgart. He got upgrades to short passing, long passing, ball control, reactions, interceptions, and goalkeeping stats. His overall went up by 2 to 65. Next up is Nanasi from Strasbourg. He got upgrades to crossing, finishing, dribbling, long passing, ball control, acceleration, sprint speed, jumping, long shots. His overall went up by 2 to 75. Potential went up by 2 to 84. Next up is Paolo Bernardo from Celtic. He got upgrades to crossing, finishing, volleys, dribbling, curve, free kicks, balance, long shots, interceptions, and a couple other things there. His overall went up to 73, potential went up to 84. Next up, we have Bit Shiabu. He got upgrades to short passing, dribbling, ball control, reactions, aggression, interceptions, marking, standing tackle, sliding tackle, composure, and overall, which went up to 69, potential went up to 84. Next up is Mark Guiyu from Chelsea. He got upgrades as well. His overall went up to 69, and his potential stays at 84. Next up is Sutalo from Ajax. He got an overall upgrade to 78, potential upgrade to 84. Madueke from Chelsea is up next. He didn't get any overall or potential upgrades, but he did get a few stat upgrades. Prati got a potential downgrade to 84 now, and a few other stat upgrades. Bade from Sevilla got upgrades, and his overall went up to 78. Van Bommel from AZ Alkmaar. Got an overall upgrade to 70. George Jensen from Chelsea got a lot of different stat changes. Look at that. And his potential went down from 86 to 84. The Brugen from Brighton got goalkeeper upgrades and his overall went up to 77. Colwell from Chelsea got an overall upgrade to 78. Mancini from Roma got an overall upgrade to 83, potential upgrade to 84. Angels from Celtic got an overall upgrade to 73, potential upgrade to 84. Fernandez from Velez Sarsfield got a potential upgrade to 83 and an overall upgrade to 71. Bove from Fiorentina got an upgrade to his overall, 75 now. Nianzu from Sevilla got an upgrade to his overall, 73 up to 75. Gulaxi from Leipzig got a potential upgrade to 80 and an overall upgrade to 83. Kusanov from Lenz got an overall upgrade to 74, potential upgrade to 83. Samu Costa from Mallorca got an overall upgrade to 75, potential upgrade to 83. Castro from Bologna got an upgrade. His overall is now 74, potential is now 83. Pasili from Roma got an upgrade to his overall, 66 now, potential upgrade to 83. Baleba from Brighton got a potential upgrade to 83. Nico Melamed from Almeria got a potential upgrade to 83, overall upgrade to 75. Bernardo Vital from Real Zaragoza got an overall upgrade to 73, potential upgrade to 83. And then we've got Dibbling from Southampton who got an overall upgrade to 64 and a potential upgrade to 81. I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like and remember to subscribe and hit the thumbnail in the middle to watch another FC25 video.